Say hello, David. Okay. Hello, David. We're here at the campground. God let us here. There's a nice family there from Missouri. They got all the they got their kids with them, and this is where like we're like on the bayou. David's tent. This is called brackish brackish water. It's where the salt water and the fresh water meet each other, and you can catch like both salt water and and fresh water in here. Fish. We're like in an RV park with a little campsite. There's a couple palm trees. And... Here's my tent. Going swimming over here. Tell everybody hi, dude. This is what's your name again? Xylus. Xylus. Hey man, you better ask your dad, Xylus. Don't get in the water unless your dad says it's okay. You better ask him. This is a tent. You better go ask him, dude. Don't get in trouble. <laughs> Love. Hey. hey. What? Love. Love. Hey. Hey. Love. What are you doing? Hey. Well, we're gonna go and uh I guess this ministry. Why not? Today is the day of day of salvation. Today is the day the Lord has created. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Let us have clean hands and a pure heart so we can come to the Lord boldly and proclaim His truth so the devil can't go to God and blame us. Repenting of sins today, folks. Today is the day of salvation. Repent and turn to Jesus today. Love. Real love. Kind of says repent or you're gonna to go to hell. That kind of love. Not the kind everybody's talking about in the building. Jesus is coming. And if people don't turn from their sin, they're gonna to go to hell. God's not playing with people. He's not playing with their religion either. Jesus is awesome, but we got things to do for him and nobody wants to do it. And you know what I mean? But they want to do their own things and well you know. I'm not sure he was that nice when he was here all the time. <laughs> Y'all have a good day, folks. His name is Love. I tell people, I tell people, Jesus, Jesus took the monkey off my back and put a cat on it. I'm a prophet. God delivered me six years ago for one hour. Took a needle out of my arm outside in the park. He filled me with His Holy Spirit. And he sent me on about His business. And everybody hates me, but you know what? They don't hate me. They hate Him because He sent me, and I'm not. You can come pedal, ma'am. You're more than welcome to. Right, Dave? Yeah. Time is short, right? Time is short. People need to get about their father's business, right? That's right. Uh, could it be any more, any more but God? There's a sign right there, and it says, Ken, Ken Wise. Ken Wise. What's going on, YouTubers? This is uh, Brother Kenny and Brother David coming at you. Say hi, David. Hi, David. That's his trademark. Say hello, love. See, he did his head like that. Today is the day of salvation. Jesus Christ is coming. And, and in the Bible it says that if you love him, you will keep his commandments. And he commanded us all to go out and preach repentance and baptism in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, which is Jesus, and being indwelled with the Holy Spirit. God commanded us all out to the highways and the byways to, to do his work. And if we call ourselves the name and name of Christian, we should be out doing our Father's work, not sitting in a building or on a couch thinking what a good job we did for Jesus today when we have done nothing. 
faith without works is dead and the Lord Jesus is coming and how much faith will he find when he comes I don't know about you guys but you know I'm, I walk in it says seek your salvation with fear and trembling and I want to fear and tremble for the Lord and, and have that that reverence for him because he's a holy God and he loves us and he wants us to do his business and faith without works is dead and we have must go out and we must plead with people to come to Jesus and repent of their sins we must go out and be about our Father's business because time is short and the rapture is going to happen. And what will you do if you get left behind and you find out you're lukewarm? He says if the lukewarm people, he rather not know them. He's just going to spew them out of his mouth. And Man, can you imagine that? Time is short, my friends. And What do you do? You go out and work for Jesus. He's done beautiful things for each and every one of us. If we call ourselves a Christian, we're truly converted. You'll love him and you'll go out and keep his commandments and do what he says to do. I just encourage each one of you to get up off your couch today and go out and do something for Jesus. Whatever, it's, if it's helping somebody homeless to love the unlovable and, and be kind to someone and show them the love of Jesus and tell them that Jesus loves them and go out and, 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 and instead of doing it for yourselves, do for others. Because that'll take, mind, that'll take your mind off your situation and God will come in and work in your life. Be selfless and... Deny yourself and pick up your cross and follow Lord Jesus. He loves us. May uh, your day be blessed and may our, our, our paths be narrow. And narrow is the path. If you be there, that find it. The Lord Jesus is coming. You know, and he's, he's coming back for those who do his will. May God bless you today and... Uh, I don't know, David, do you have anything to add? Try to repent as much as you can of, of everything you know you've done wrong and of any habits, of any, um, of any stronghold you have. Repent of them before the Lord and, and He will lift you up if you repent of them, if you lower yourself before Him and beg for His forgiveness and, 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 and show, show your repentance by your works. And part of those works is doing the work of repentance. Well said. May the Lord Jesus bless you today. We love you. My cat loves you. And most of all, your heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, loves you. Have a blessed day, everyone. In Jesus' name. Look at these cross made out of shells, isn't that something? What do you think, love?